Welcome to Tip TV ADVFN Trade of the Day. I'm joined by leading technician Zach Muir. Zach, we're going to talk about Rand Gold Resources. Um, you, you've turned bullish overnight on gold. <sighs> no, not, not, not so overnight. Over Christmas. Not so, yeah, over Christmas. Um, let's just say that gold looks a little bit better, especially for me with the, with the dollar weakening a bit after the Fed's uh, do dovish comments. Uh, as far as Rand Gold is concerned, um, it was... Uh, leading the way, uh, or uh, there was a turnaround uh, in shape ahead of the turnaround in gold, which bottomed out around eleven dollars, eleven hundred and twenty dollars or so. Um, so mid mid uh, December, we were around the fifty two, fifty three pence area, and there was positive divergence uh, with the oscillator there. Now we're above the fifty day average at sixty one eighty six, and while we hold that, I think we can head up to seventy to seventy five, which uh, is the two hundred day moving average at seventy, and then up to. November resistance towards 75, but that's the most uh, that's the most sort of strong I would get on on Rangold at the moment. So intermediate rally, um, it, we don't know yet whether this is uh, the base for gold, but it looks like so. There's a little bit more upside there right. for uh, Interesting Rangold. is a few gaps on the charts, and one sort of in we're basically in November, the beginning of November, we've got to close above that. That's quite encouraging for the bulls, isn't that's it? That's encouraging. Um, I think that it's also encouraging that even after recent gains, we're still not overbought. Um, so it's been a slow, steady rise. Um, bit head and shoulders uh, like there with the which you know, is the bullish, right? Well, well uh, the pattern here to, to get yeah to get back to the right shoulder would be towards the seventy pounds uh, area. Understood, Zach. Thank you very much indeed. The uh, Tip TV trade of the day by Bovis Homes around the eight hundred pence level. Objective eight six five stops above uh, or probably below seven seventy on the basis that. Uh, uh, house builders could, uh, well, I suppose that the dip in the house builders will see a revival in demand over 2017. Mm -hmm. Just, I mean, on, on you, you know, you've given us a the selection of stocks, which one would be the, 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 the priority, let's say, for your portfolio at the moment? Which I one like, would be your favourite? I, I like 3i. I think that 3i is bound much, much, much higher uh, relatively quickly with a very low uh, risk to your capital.